This video was created by Vinyl Lake Puma of Vinyl Lake Puma Gaming. What's going on everybody? This is Vinyl Lake Puma and today I'm back with another Borderlands 2 video for you guys and we are continuing mods on PC and this will be episode 3 and it will be on Assault Rifles. Now for those of you that don't know, uh, Assault Rifles in Borderlands 2 are generally considered to be underpowered. So what I wanted to do is I wanted to make a couple assault rifles and then show another assault rifle that I thought was pretty cool and they are modded weapons, obviously. Now, the first one that we're going to be looking at is the Pimpifier Mach 1, or at least that's what I've decided to call it, because I thought that was kind of cool and better than Captain Scarlet's Kerb Blaster. Now, essentially what this thing is, is it is a Shredifier plus a Pimpernel plus the Kerb Blaster to give it a little bit more damage. And as you can see here, up against Mad Ma, it's just gonna totally wreck him. I mean, his health literally disintegrates, and that is a beautiful sight to see, because generally with other assault rifles, it would probably take you a little while to pull something like that off. Now, I also wanted to go ahead and show this up against regular enemies, and I mean, you pretty much hit them in the knee with this thing, and they are pretty much dead. And even if you hit, like, them, I guess, like, center mass, I mean, they're gonna pretty much die also. And again, it's basically the Pimpernel, which is essentially one of the best sniper rifles in Borderlands 2 with a really fast fire rate and in assault rifle form. Now, this next gun is another one that I did make, and I've decided to call this one the Black Mamba. Now, what this thing is, is it is a Jacob Scarab with the, of course, the doll barrel, and then it is a doll manufacturer. Now, what this does is it gives it a burst fire, and I also went ahead and I added the Lady Fist for some enhanced critical hit damage, and I also added the uh, quad shotgun to give it a crap ton of projectiles. And I mean, this thing has like 19 projectiles. It's like 250,000 damage times 19. So whatever you see in front of you is pretty much gonna die, as you can see there from all of those generic bandits. Now, this final one was on the Vault Modders Forum. Uh, this one was made by Ultimate Attacker. And what this thing is, is it is a dual element weapon. It is a fire and slag weapon. It's a combination of the saw bar with the infinity. And what's cool about this thing is this thing actually when you shoot it, it replenishes your entire ammo pool. And you'll get to see this a little er later when I start firing this thing. And I mean, that's pretty cool. Plus it also has been set up with uh, sight none, so you can move around really fast while aiming, and that's pretty cool too. But as you can see here, while I'm shooting this thing, uh, you pretty much get um, free ammo. So, I mean, no complaints there. And this, of course, is based on the Infinity and the Saw Bar, and I believe it's also just, like, based on Vladoff assault rifles in general. Uh, but anyway, guys, I think that's going to pretty much wrap up this video. Uh, if you did like this video, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe as I am going to make an episode 4 of Mods on PC for Borderlands 2. Otherwise, take care, and I'll see you all next time.